Ryan, a uh, fantastic first round yesterday and you followed that with a solid round today. You, are you pleased with how your performance has been so far? Uh, I think given the weather, I'm, I am pleased about it. I felt like we kind of got the harder end of the draw. Uh, given yesterday, I heard it was sunny and warm and then we basically had this yesterday. So um, I am pleased with finishing under par and you know, five under, I will take that going into the weekend. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, that is one of those things. Does it play on your minds when you think, you know, whichever, if you start in the morning and then you, you know, you get dealt the, the rough ends of the, the cars each day, does that play on your mind a lot? I think it's it's no different than if you get caught up in like bad bounces or lucky bounces. It's like you can't do anything about it. So I tried yesterday just going out and making the most of it. I mean, we come to Scotland expecting wind and rain. So for it to be windy yesterday afternoon, I'm like, well, I expect it for the whole year. So I can't. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> you know, it's fun to play. You get to use your imagination a little more. Um, this course, you know, allows that, like the way the green contours of the greens and some of the fairways that, you know, there's some holes that do help with the downwind. So take advantage of those. Have you, joined, have you enjoyed that learning process over the years of, of coming and taking on this, this Lynx golf? I would have to say 2012 when I played my first Lynx round, um, I think it was Royal Liverpool. Um, it was a, a learning experience. And I think throughout the years I've learned, okay, this is how you have to play these, you know, lower flighted tee shots, get creative, get the ball on the ground quicker, um, you know, take stuff off of shots just to get the spins down, try not to fight the wind more so play it. So yeah, I think um, you learn in the process to avoid those crazy, sh you know, shot, the shots that the wind takes like off the moon. <laughs> And how unfamiliar are the conditions here for you coming from California as well? I'd have to say it's about as opposite as it gets. Uh, we get some wind in Arizona, but uh, the temperature is about half of what it is at home. So a bit different. And seeing this wind, are you, are you tempted to get out on the water? Because I know you're a big fan of that. Oh, I, you know, I was looking at the windsurfer out there and now the kite surfers are out there. And I, I, would, I would do that if I had the opportunity. I would definitely take it on. There's a wetsuit. It would be fine. Fantastic. So. Uh, just one last question about the golf. So looking yeah. forward to... Um, Take you on the rest of the field at the weekend. I am. I'm very much looking forward to it. I think I just stick to my game plan and um, one shot at a time, and try not to like get upset when you get out of position. I mean, I think I look at it more as fun. Okay, where am I at, and how can I get this back to close to the hole? So, uh, with that mindset, I think I'm looking forward to Saturday and Sunday with whatever the weather's supposed to bring. Fantastic. Best yeah. of luck. Thanks.